What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel and thank you for coming back to a whole new video. Today's video is going to be about the Nintendo NX and yes, I know Nintendo has been in the news quite a bit for the last few days. A lot of stuff came out last week and I didn't even really get a chance to talk to you guys about it because there's been a lot of new things happening in my life. My office was just insane last week. I had a lot of stuff going on at work and uh, it took a while for me to actually get a, a moment to, to stop and take a breath and look at gaming news and talk to you guys about it. But today's news is something I want to talk to you guys about as far as Nintendo's price for the Nintendo NX because what we've kind of grown accustomed to is when new hardware is released is going to have a nice hearty healthy price tag that's going to be usually a financial decision for us to make when we buy these things playstation 4 was 400 xbox one was 500 when it first came out and tons of people went out and bought them it's really sometimes a difficult decision to just buy new hardware right when it's released the good news is nintendo is saying that this will not be an issue for the nintendo nx i'll drop a link in the description nintendo nx price will be cheaper than expected the Nintendo NX price point will be, quote, cheaper than even the vast majority expects, end quote, as more sources start to open up after it emerged that the dedicated game platform will be a portable handheld console with detachable controllers. As part of a wider article that explores the pros and cons around the concept, MCV cites that sources have suggested that the console will be cheaper than online speculation has so far predicted. Quote, early online speculation about the pricing for the NX expects it to be cheaper than current consoles, but from what we've heard, it's going to be cheaper than even the vast majority expect. This is a machine that is targeting the mass market, and Nintendo certainly plans for it to have a mass market price. Price is one Wii U mistake Nintendo is determined not to repeat. This could be the NX's single biggest win, end quote. The Wii struck success early after it arrived at retail with a competitive and irresistible $179 price point. Whereas the Wii U and Nintendo 3DS, Nintendo learned the hard way about missing such sweet spots, which saw the handheld receive a substantial price cut months after it launched worldwide. This is awesome. First of all, let me say, I probably said it before, you guys may have heard me say this already. The Nintendo NX sounds extremely appealing to me. It doesn't have to be as powerful as the PS4, or as powerful as the Xbox One. As long as it's able to get good ports of games that are coming to the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, I'll be satisfied. It sounds like this is going to be the most powerful handheld ever made. Just like the Xbox Project Scorpio sounding like it's going to be the most powerful console ever made, this definitely sounds like it's going to be the most powerful handheld ever. And I'm a huge handheld fan, but the reason I kind of stepped away from it is because I want the console experience. If you can have a truly console experience in the palm of your hand, then that's very, very appealing. And when you can take that on the go and play with other people by detaching another controller from it, that's even more appealing. And if this thing comes out with this kind of technology, this kind of monitor, two controllers, a dock that you can play on your TV with, and it's at a decent price point, $199, something like that. Oh my God, everybody's going to have this thing. It's going to be a huge success. You guys let me know in the comments what you think would be a good price for the NX when it first launches. Now, of course, they said that People are already speculating as to what the price will be, but as of right now, they've all been wrong because it's going to be cheaper than what everybody's guessing. You tell me what do you think a good price for this handheld console hybrid is going to be. Be sure to give a thumbs up, guys. Show support for the channel. Follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and tell all your friends about me. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time.